Subaru. My apologies for the wait. Here you are, masters. If you'll excuse me. Oh, hey, Misa. Can I borrow that tray for a second? Uh, wait! Oh. Don't! Oh, that's not one of our trays. Sorry about that. I made it to help with resistance training. Wh wh what's that thing even made of? It, it, it The floor! It went through It's floor. just a piece of scrap oh. metal I found. This place is perfect. Miss President, are you doing that because the sports festival is coming up? Right of course I am. I will get first place in all categories and collect trophies left and right. For the sake of the women of Seika High, I will succeed. And on that note, the 81st Seika High School Sports Festival is now underway. Everyone do your best. Thing. To be expected, you can learn. Seika High Sports Festival is a battle between all the classes, but there are only enough girls here for one female team. And this year, there's been a change to the rules that's raised the stakes even higher. For the first time, each event has an award. These prizes go to the team whose member gets first place. On top of that, this morning's main event, the obstacle course, has a very special uh prize. <laughs> It's too late for that. <laughs> it was decided in a school-wide survey and the numbers don't lie. You're the girl we want to kiss from. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry, this is all my fault. I meant to get rid of that reward before the festival, but I completely forgot. It's too late to turn back now that the whole school knows about it. A kiss from Sakura Hanazono's lips. I go to will do whatever it takes to steal <laughs> it. I promise, I won't let that happen. Because if anyone comes anywhere near you, I will <gasps> eliminate him! <laughs> Don't think I'll be defeated that easily! <laughs> Looks like things are even more heated this year, huh? Actually, I was absent last year. Hmm? This will be the first sports festival I've gone to. I'm really excited about it, to be honest. Usui! <laughs> Why won't you run for us in the 1,000 meter dash? You're our fastest guy! The prize is 30 extra large cutlet curries. That's three whole months worth of food! I'm not racing. He told us the same thing last year, too, didn't he? Let's just give up. Maybe we have a chance of winning it on our own. And the Sega Sports Festival has kicked off at last. Live coverage will be brought to you courtesy of me, Hagimoto of the Broadcasting Club. Uh -huh. Which class will be the victor? And does the girls' team stand a chance? First up, as always, is the 100-meter dash. It looks like the competition is going to be fierce. Student Council President Ayazawa of the girls' team already wants an aura of incredible determination. The competition is about to start. The prize at stake is one month's worth of your favorite song broadcasted 
I'm gonna take first and blast nothing but hardcore death metal with extreme guitar riffs. Hmm? What's happened to Class 2-6? Yeah. Looks like he's frozen up on the starting line. And sure enough, President Ayazawa is already taking the lead. Huh? Yeah. A demon. I'm scared. <laughs> Thanks to her, we'll be able to sit back and relax for once. I figured something like this would happen. He's already kicking our butts and the festival just started! Not to worry, there are still plenty of prizes First remaining. First place, the 200 meter dash goes to the girls team! Not again! First place in the 400 meter dash goes to the girls team! Victory! First place in the 1500 meter dash goes to the girls team! You think we're gonna stand for this? She can't just go out every um, single there's time! There's no rule saying she can't compete in every event. It's within bounds. So what? This isn't fair to us. We suck! Unfair? Are you freaking kidding me? I've been fighting with everything I've got! <sighs> Misaki, are you all right? Here, it's oxygen. Will participants in the chicken fight please assemble? The next event is the chicken fight. Misaki, you should try and get some rest. Damn, I thought I'd be able to compete in everything by myself. You don't have to do that, Misaki. After all, the girls' team has a handicap. Even if we don't compete, we'll still get points. We may get points. But we won't get the first place prize, will we? Huh? I want to get as many of those prizes as I possibly can. I want the sports festival to be something the girls can actually enjoy for once. It's time to take a tiny break. All right. Okay. I sat out the chicken fight, so I have to do my best on this. Oh, gosh! Oh, she did it! She did it! Oh, it. Oh, it. Oh, it. Oh, it. Goda, are you sure we have a shot at getting first place? <laughs> if push comes to shove, I'll do whatever it takes to win. And now, the final morning event. The obstacle course is about to begin. It's a competition with no limits for entry. Be the one to race across the school grounds, clearing obstacles left and right to claim victory and take first place. And who will be the one to win that coveted kiss? I will protect Sakura! This is bad. She's already out for blood and the competition hasn't even started yet. Do you really want to go up against her, Gota? Of course. Like I said, I'll do whatever it takes. Contestants are already out, and the top contenders are Goda of Class 3-2 and Miss Ayazawa of 2-1. The two of them have just entered the pool area. Falling into the water at any point will mean instant disqualification. But no matter what, I have to protect Sakura! <laughs> Usui, what's the deal? Oh, my. With, With this, it's all taking commanding lead. D damn it. I have to catch up to... Although I really like it when you give it your all, I think it's safe to say you can just leave this to me. I got this one locked down. <laughs> He's so fast! I have to hurry and catch up to them. And, and next, next up, up is the volleyball, volleyball court. court. Goda is all alone in first place. place. <laughs> yes, at this rate, Sakura Hanazono's lips are all mine. That was a pretty cheap trick you pulled back there, Mr. Goda. <laughs> Whoa, what a surprise this is. Usui Takami is tied for the top spot, and President Ayazawa is quickly gaining on them. <laughs> on top of that, the volleyball club has launched its attack. The top two contenders have entered the school grounds. The goal is in sight! Trip! 
Too bad. Looks like you missed. <gasps> Goal! Yeah! First place goes to Usui Takami of Class 2-2! And Excuse in second me. place is President Ayazawa. And so, as our first place winner, Usui Takami will now receive his victory kiss from Sakura Hanazono! What's this? The prize is to receive a kiss? Uh, uh. Then I'll pass. Huh? But, uh... I'm not the type that likes being kissed. I'm more about doing the kissing myself. Uh, and so the kiss goes to our next runner-up, President Ayazawa! Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> If I had just kept going, I would have gotten second place! That was awfully lucky. <laughs> yeah! Finished! Isn't it perfect? Great work, Kuratatsu! I think I might cry! Now then, we'll, we'll be, be breaking, breaking for lunch before our afternoon event. <laughs> You sure have been busy lately, haven't you? My class got out early today, so I thought I would come by to watch you. Uh, Susan, huh? I've learned that postcard giveaways aren't the only way to win prizes. Next week, the neighborhood committee is also having a sports festival, and two weeks from now is the shopping mall sports festival. Enter those, okay? Uh. I ditched the sports fest and sew up this dress? Am I not the best? Kuratatsu, good job! You're so talented that it's creepy, man! So when do you think we should give Misa her special present, guys? She's gonna love it. Huh? Hey, someone's coming! Hurry up and hide that thing! But where? 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 Over I don't here. see it! Huh? Hiding on one of these bags full of clothes. Here, I'll put it in here before someone sees! And now, we will begin the afternoon events. Hell-bent on not participating in this that I forgot all about it. Hey, President, are you doing this event too? <laughs> Actually, I think I'm gonna go ahead and pass on this one. <laughs> but why? Pretty ironic, huh? The costume race almost seems like it was made just for you. It's all right. It's not like wearing a silly costume is going to give away your secret part-time job. Let's cosplay, baby. You want to get slapped? If you do it, I'll do it too. Just go by yourself! Misaki, please leave the costume race to me. Uh, uh, huh? Each team must have at least one member compete in this as well. But asking you to enter every single event is far too unreasonable. I couldn't do that in good conscience. Uh, I'll be doing it too, so just rest, okay? Also, this event seems to be a magnet for others such as myself, who are not athletic in the slightest. Therefore, I feel that I must contribute. Oh! But don't you have to change clothes in front of everyone? Indeed, but fear not. I have prepared this poncho exactly for that. Well, Shizuko, you've got it all planned! With this, there's no worry. That's not true, Shizuko. I couldn't live with myself. If I sent some defenseless girl into the midst of a pack of wolves butt naked! Therefore, I will compete in this event. Continuing on. Will the participants for the 12th event, the costume race, please assemble at the start line? It's okay. Line. It's okay. No one will know I'm a maid. President, you're moving your arms and legs in tandem and it looks weird. Really... Are you sure you're okay with being the only girl in the entire event? No one else wanted to do it. I'll be fine, thanks. Okay, go for a costume that doesn't stand out and head straight for the goal. Oh man, it's about to start. Just having to watch this stupid thing is painful. The participants have absolutely zero motivation. The costumes are crap, and the reward is even crappier. The principal's lucky academic ability increasing pencil? Who the hell would want that thing? Oh, Miss President, are you competing for the girls' team again? Uh, Yukimura! Huh? Mr. Usui, you too? But isn't this event mainly for the weaker competitors who aren't very good yeah, at Yeah, I'm just doing it because the president's in it too. Are you not the athletic type, Yukimura? Yeah, I'm awful. When it comes to sports, all I do is drag the rest of the team down. But here at Seika, they have an event that even people like me can participate in. And that makes me really happy. 
I had to miss out on last year's festival because I had a cold, so this year will be my first time to participate. I see. I'm sure you'll do your best. Right. <laughs> I'm sure you'll do your best too, won't you, Miss Cosplay? Before we begin, allow me to explain the rules. A costume selection zone has been prepared 50 meters from the starting point. Please do not take a single look at the contents when selecting your bag. Another 50 meters away is the changing room. If you can put your costume on the dark and run one lap around the track, you win. The most important point in this event is choosing a costume that is easy to change into. Now then, all participants, please assemble at the starting line. Hey, wait a second, isn't that, isn't that Usui? Why is he competing in this event out of all the other ones? Well, guess we better get this over with. That sure is a pain in the ass, though. Okay, on your mark. They're tired after only three seconds? Oh, this is throwing me off. Oh, Miss President. Come on, hurry up. Which one will you choose? Uh, he's okay. enjoying himself way too much. Still, there's no way of knowing what's inside each bag. At any rate, choosing one that's full of lots of clothes is probably the safest bet. Now I have to hurry and change before the tent is crawling with guys. Where could it have gone? Why, why, why? 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 I put so much hard work into that costume, too. It's so dark. How the heck am I even supposed to know what I'm putting on? Still, this feels really familiar somehow. President, what costume did you get? An illusion! That's just some kind of optical illusion just now! <laughs> yeah, just keep telling yourself that, President. But it's definitely a maid outfit. What the hell? Of all things, why this? I bet you went for the bag with the most clothes, didn't you? Anyway, what's the problem? If you think about it, it's the perfect match. After all, you're a girl. Yeah, but that's beside the point. Just take a look at those other guys. <laughs> that's rough. Right? Now then, will you change yourself, or do I have to do it by force? Uh -oh. Get off making a nasty, no, stupid, perverted kidding. comment Why like that! Uh, uh, what was that dog-like noise just now? Uh, Yukimura! Uh, that voice is Miss President? I'm sorry, did I do something wrong? Please forgive me, whatever it was I did, I uh, No, it was an accident. I'll leave right now. Uh, wait, Yukimura! He's just so focused that he's not even listening. Still, I really think you should be worrying about yourself instead of Yukimura. Oh, I almost forgot. What am I gonna do with this? My outfit's transformed! That's not it, President. Huh? Who's in the maid outfit? Is that Yukimura? Is it just me, or does he actually pull that off pretty well for a guy? <laughs> I bet he packed that costume himself because he wanted to stand out. Huh? What are you saying? Look at him. I think he's trying to show oh, off. Is Hilarious. that it? No, he you're wrong! He thought he spice to the event by dressing up all special. How kind of him. Looks like it worked. <laughs> I can't believe those guys. I'll show them. No, you have to change into a costume before you exit the tent. Otherwise, you'll be disqualified. So? This isn't the time for that! It can't be helped, can it? Mm. This is Yukimura's first time participating, and with his personality being the way it is, he's really trying. The truth is that out of all the people participating in the event, no one gives a damn about it anyway. Uh, it's one thing for them to not be athletic or good at sports, but no one will care about an event where the participants don't even try. And if someone does make an effort to succeed, in the end, it's gonna be futile. So what you're telling me is that all we can do is sit back while they point their fingers and laugh at him for trying? I can't! I just can't. I won't allow it. <laughs> Doing all right there, Miss May? <laughs> Feelings, did we? Man, that's hilarious. What the? Are you all right? Pick yourself up, Yukimura. Let's finish this together. 
Who the hell is that guy? Hey, look, there's someone else coming. Usui! Whoa, that's crazy! Those guys took their costumes to another level! Wait, Miss President. Did he say president? What are those two doing something like the costume race for? And they're actually taking that seriously! What if we are? You got a problem with that? Uh, no, no problem at all. For a second, I'd started to convince myself that it was really cool. Well, what do you say we race to the goal and cross the finish line holding hands? Just shut up and run so we can get this over with. You know, Miss President, that costume actually turned out I said good. shut up! Just keep it moving! Uh, guys, thank you very much, Miss President! <laughs> idea there were costumes like this. Uh, actually, we just threw a bunch of different things together and ended up with these. <laughs> Miss President, uh -huh. that's a disqualification. Uh, sorry about that. Still, I, I thought they ended up looking pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> Impressive, Miss President. In a single day, you've managed to cover your entire body in wounds. Say, Usui, I was wondering, don't you think there's a way to make the costume race better somehow? I, I think we could get the participants to take things more seriously with some improvements. Maybe if the costumes were something cooler, like superheroes or video game characters, people would actually want to participate. Maybe I should bring this up with the student council. <laughs> sure, why not? No, oh, really? President, good work today. I spent the whole week slaving away making it just for me, so all for nothing. <laughs> written right here, like this, huh? Mr. Usui, you're not putting enough Yukimura, into it. Yukimura, looks like you've got it rough next episode. <laughs> and the three idiots appear, too. Hey, now, we won't let you call us the three idiots anymore. Like they say, to know me is to rub me. That's not it, shiro -yan. To love me is to grope me. That's huh? it, right? The title has idiots written in it? Why? Why?